Yo, Philly 254 living life. Back at it. So recently I did do a video discussing how to get Spotify working on your Steam Deck to kind of get your little playlist music going while you're gaming. That's cool. So now we're going to do a quick discussion on how to quickly switch songs and control your music without having to actually switch apps. And surprise, surprise, there's a plugin for that and it's from the Decky Loader. So what you want to do is open up your Decky Loader. As you can see right there, if you need to know how to install it, I got a video talking about that as well. Go to the little Decky store. Once you're there, you can search it or you can just do a little actual browse for it, which I'm going to do. What you're looking for is music control. So just go down to the M's and there you go. Go ahead and hit the install button. Cool thing about Decky Loader, once you install the new plugins, it, all, it automatically opens Decky Loader. Yours won't look like mine. I got a lot of plugins, but you're going to go down to, uh, see, I already clicked the wrong one, control tools. But you're going to go down to, to the actual music controls plugin. Once there, you see, hey, so how do I get started? How do I get Spotify working? Well, let's go take a look at the info. So under the info, you'll see what it says. Music control allows you to control any media play, playback that is currently running that implements the NPRS DBUS interface. So it lets you run Spotify, Cider, or Cedar, whatever, Chromecast slash Firefox and Strawberry. Meaning, what that all that means is you need to have it running in the first place before you can do anything. So you got to actually open Spotify and then you can do it. So let's just go back, open up Spotify real quick hit play on a little of course you're not gonna hear any of this again because i'm not trying to get copyrighted but hit the little play button so it's playing the young ti or whatever i'm gonna hit my quick settings button real quick on the right side to open up the decky loader and we're gonna go we're gonna go right back oh sorry we're gonna go back to the very beginning so you can see it from scratch from scratch open up the settings and there you go ti is running so from here you, you can look at your different controls you got going here you can scrub backwards or forwards whatever to get to where part you want to get to in the song which is pretty cool you have your little back button, so you can actually just go all the way back to the very beginning of the song, or you can press it again and go to the previous song that was being played, which I'm gonna demonstrate here. You have your pause button, which you already know what the pause button does, just pause the music. And then you have your forward button, it takes you back to the to the next song. Then you have a playback volume. So this is, controls the volume for the actual song, not your master volume. So you wanna control your master volume, you still gotta use the little rockers on the top. Now you're gonna see it kind of glitching out, getting going a little crazy because I'm doing both of them. But this playback volume controls the play, the mute, the sound of the music itself, so that way it doesn't overpower the sounds of the game or whatever you got going on. So that's perfectly cool. Just keep, you just gotta make sure you master volumes wherever you want it to be. And that, in a nutshell, is it. It's that simple, ain't it? Overall, I feel like this is a hot, a hot, hot plug-in. If you're using the Spotify plugin, that is. If you're not using the Spotify plugin, this, does, this plugin means nothing to you. But if you're using the Spotify plugin, or say Spotify plugin, not a plugin, but the app, if you play music on your Steam Deck, this actually will help you out tremendously because you don't have to switch apps to change songs or change the volume or whatever. You can just straight up do it from right here and call it a day. So I have none but high praise for this app or this plugin. It works out flawlessly. You saw it kind of glitching a little bit when I was messing with the volume and the actual rocker volume on the Steam Deck, but that was just because I was doing about the same time. I mean, it is what it is. If you like more Steam Deck news, walkthroughs, playthroughs, guides, reviews, lives, like and subscribe. Cruise through the playlist. And I'm out.